Hi everyone, it's me Brian back with video and this is a map I made called this is I'm sorry for not uploading recently, it's just I've been focusing on map making and this is my new map. GM Grey Stuff V3. So right away, I'm not actually boxing it, I'm actually like using I'm actually like making walls individually, which which makes so I can have like little nook and crannies. Where I can have little things where I can offshoot more. So here's another here's a room I made. It's a bit bright in my opinion. Here's another room. It's kind of cozy, but it's weird. That kind of looks like it would be the thumbnail. For some reason, that kind of looked like it'd be the thumbnail to a bad G mod the most space map. I mean, the most space maps are the best, or like one of the best genres on Gary's mod. In my opinion, one of my favorite maps is Liminal Hotel. Okay, here's another area I made. This is I don't know what this is supposed to be. You can also see a little bit of area we're gonna explore later, which is actually over, which actually is over there. So there's another thing behind there. Another thing behind here. Which is if you go over here, I, I don't. The I, green line was a bad choice. I don't know if it's ambient or brightness. I think it's ambient. Go up here, and you can go go inside of this thing. This took this took a bit of time, for so, but it was basically nothing. That that hurt. Uh, okay. So now we're gonna go try to go over there. So first things first, we're gonna to go through here, and this is the main sandbox area. We can already see a place I'm dreading going to. This map has several dark rooms, construct on steroids, without nostalgia. So you can see this building right here. We're gonna go in. It might sound really enthusiastic. Actually, I'm gonna go in here first. This is this is like one of the only this is one of the only buildings that's not connected to something else. Or rooms, I should say. Actually, there's quite a few rooms that's not connected to something else. But you can see the bad green line. So I'm gonna go in here with a few areas. So this is originally supposed to have a window that's peeking the skybox, but the map, but I screwed up there. The the map uh, this kept on rendering and screwing up the view and like de-rendering and it was really immersion breaking. This is what you're gonna see this a lot. These random these random rooms that lead up to the sky. Like this one. It's another one. There you go. Now we're gonna go up there. So immediately right away you can see with the window, you can see the from the window, there's another one of these rooms. Except this one has glass on top and a weird thing. I, I thought that looked nice at first, I think I'm sorely mistaken. This is a pretty nice view. I actually think I put this in one of the images on the workshop, since it is on the workshop. I'll post a, I might put a link in the description if you guys want to see it. A skylight, and you can view the area, you can view spawn and stuff. Here, I probably fixed it up. Here's a tunnel that leads to a catwalk and a house I'm not very proud of, but, but it's derpy looking. Can see a, you can see a sub two windows. That's, that's another one of those rooms. You can also go back down there. This actually connects over here. You can get in through that and then go up there. So we're gonna go over here. And it's pretty kind of neat. We go over here. And into this room. And 
it's a bit it's not that spacey. You, I don't know why I added all these. I think I added this for sandbox reason, reason or just or just because I was bored and I wanted to add something. But I want to make this ma map massive, which it is. I'm gonna no clip later. I show you guys the scale of it. So now we're gonna explore that house. So it's not really much, it's just a way too bright light and a window. Okay, now we go over here, which this will, there's gonna be a, there's gonna be a corridor that leads back, that leads over to the dark area. Green lighting. And there's a, there's a cool radio over here. And... Sophisticated minds continue to imbue him with romantic power, giving him such dangerous poetic labels as the one free man. That's not my property. Of the way. Okay, nice propaganda. I made this a trigger multiple, but it's not triggering multiple times. How does this work? Anger. These, when I was making the map, kept, I, I accidentally made them, like, I wasn't even using the ones, like, size one, and it, and it just, but still decided to be up one, so I had to fix that, because it looked horrible. And here's, this, was, this is actually a light recreation of V2, if you, if you pay close enough attention. This here, right here, but not the rest of this. I just made this because it was bored. Oh, I'm no clipping. There's also another one of these rooms, but there's no Easter egg there. If we go over here... Yeah, there's no Easter egg. It's just a room. Oh my god, for some I thought I fucked up. I fucked up the thing and I have to make another update. Okay, so I'm gonna go to this area. It's okay if I know clip this. So this is the area. This is the creepy area. You can see from there. And there's a doorway. And there's a long corridor. So let's walk through. And here's a blood decal I added just to be cruel to people. Water dripping. I don't know where the water is coming from. Okay, now we're gonna do the no clip. So this is the map in no clip. I think, as you can tell. And there isn't too there isn't too much to talk about. I mean, here's the sky box, which is actually boxed. Believe it or not. Despite, despite I didn't box this because this map would be, this map would get a really, this map would not really work if it was boxed. And you can actually see something. So the thing that happened with the window over there when I was developing it was it, because of how close it was to see to an area where you can view that it kept on. Loading and reloading an area we can actually see it. However, because the placement of that, because the placement of that water dripping room, you actually, it actually is not, you can actually like not see it. Maybe, maybe multiplayer, I don't think multiplayer, maybe multiplayer might be a problem. I don't know. Yes, I don't know. Alright, this is the map. I spent several hours on it. It's and I'm really proud of it. Definitely better than, uh, definitely better than the ones I thought were awesome, like Ultra or Deluxe or, God forbid, V2. That one kind of, that one was kind of bad, but still. You can actually see some stuff. 
Okay, it's no clip, of course. I'm gonna end the video right here, everyone. Goodbye.